Hello everyone out there in YouTube land. This is an age-restricted video. If you're not 18, you should probably not be watching this video. If you are 18, here's the veg garden. Bum, ba -da -bum. All right, here we are. Uh, we're making changes. Uh, we're getting rid of a lot of our cuts. Uh, Jim has already started the process of uh, uh, sprouting from seed. Um, he's got some uh, cookies and dream here that he's got cloned out. Uh, we know these are female, so he's gonna get these in there uh, and test those in on the next flower, our next flower run. Uh, we got a mother here of the cookies and dream right here, and then this is that uh, bubble gum, which we're excited about that one. And then he's got this tired old mother here that he's gonna be getting rid of. Uh, we're doing the same mid-veg formula from Nectar for the Gods with the addition of Recharge, uh, Demeter's, uh, I mean not Demeter's Destiny, well, of course that's part of the other lineup, but uh, we're using our Recharge in here and uh, we are using Mammoth P in the flower room. Alright, let's go ahead and take a look at the flower room. Okay, here we go. All right, this is week six for him. As you can see, they're reaching. They look real happy. Uh, but we do have some issues in the garden that we found. Uh, we noticed this plant over here had some clawing and some just really kind of uh, messed up uh, look to it. And I got down in there and... Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but see how all that damage is done there to that flower site? It looks like something's uh, either been chewing on it or caused it to die out. Uh, it's a brown in color you can't really see. Uh, and it's, um, it's just uh, lost any resin that it had. So uh, it's definitely suspect. So we brought it in and we put it under the microscope and we found thrips, uh, what we believe to be thrips. And if we look, there is some leaf damage on some of these here. Uh, and of course he is in week five right now, five or six. Uh, so spraying uh, anything but like a spinosad is not really an option and I don't even think at this point I would even recommend that. Um, kind of like just kind of cut your losses it's not throughout the entire garden it's just this uh, section here seems to have a problem with it and I saw some on one of these sections over here uh, so it's kind of a tough call uh, spittle said they say you can use all the way up to the time of harvest I never believe that um, I never smoke anything that I think has got chemicals on it uh, so, I mean, my recommendations obviously would probably be to just ride it out. Uh, if you have a different opinion and can help him out in any way, I'm sure Uncle Jim would totally appreciate it. Uh, yeah, but this garden is all jet fuel. Uh, looks really good. It's a shame that, uh, that he's dealing with this right now. Uh, but we'll get through it. Uh, we're kind of starting from new anyway, so once this run is done, uh, he's starting with fresh genetics, which will all be clean and all that good stuff. All right, everyone out there in YouTube land, I hope to see you at the DGC Cup. And growers love.